My name's Amy Patel and I'm a breast radiologist and I became a radiologist actually because I became enamored with breast imaging as a medical student. I had a really incredible mentor who took me under her wing and I loved all the aspects of breast imaging, women's health, procedural technique, uh, how there was a lot of patient interaction. And so in residency, I tried to keep an open mind about uh, different subspecialties, but I pretty much felt stayed in love with breast and then you know did a fellowship in breast imaging and now th that's all I do. So I have been involved with RSNA as a member since I was a trainee uh, and now I'm in my third year of practice. I renew my membership every year uh, because I feel that there are so many uh, invaluable opportunities through RSNA. Uh, I try to attend the meeting every year. Uh, I have so far for, gosh, now I think it's maybe six or seven years in a row. I think it's important to be a member of RSNA whether you're a trainee, whether you're um, out of training. Uh, just just because of all of the um, resources that RSNA provides for you. Um, I, again, I think that for RSNA, education is its strongest asset. Uh, cutting edge research, the online video content, um, the online educational content, the, the literature, there's just so much there. And then of course, you know, the actual meeting, the benefits are immense. So, you know, I renew my membership every year and hey, I get to come to the meeting for free. And that is such a huge added benefit. Because there's so many benefits to attend the meeting, a lot of mentorship sponsor opportunities can happen. Um, you know, if you're needing advice for your own clinical practice, of course the educational sessions are very robust. I, you know, arguably they're the most robust educational sessions out of all the radiology meetings offered across the world. Um, so that, you know, in and of itself is very invaluable. 